Welcome to Naturally Gated. This is Makana, a 12-year-old Tennessee walking horse mare. Recently, from feedback I got from my gated dressage mentor, Jenny Jackson, is connection is essential for riding the Tennessee walking horse. And I've, I've found that the feedback that I received from her, going from riding in like a one ounce of contact feeling to a four ounce contact feeling, has made an enormous difference in this horse's gait, in this horse's um, rhythm, especially when it comes to the mechanics of the head nodding horse. She's a naturally gated Tennessee walking horse, and one of the key uh, factors of a Tennessee walking horse flat walk is the head nod. And the head nod needs to be connected from the head, the neck, the shoulders, all connected with the hind steps. So it's really a back to front movement. So the head nod is not a head flicking up movement, but a head and neck motion through the shoulders connected with the hind steps. So, and all that is essentially important that the rider is in connection with the bit. And that's not meaning that I'm pulling back. That's not what I mean. It's the rider riding from back with an engaged abs that lifts the back to a neutral to round position. So the horse is traveling, stepping deep under the body. The horse is stepping under the seat. Um, the rider's aids and balance. The rider has a feel of a four ounce feeling or more. I mean, whatever your horse needs. I, some horses can be lighter because they're more in self carriage. This horse at this time needs four ounces. I was riding with loose floppy reins, but my horse wasn't in connection. So as my horse learns connection, perhaps she'll be back to an, uh, a one ounce feeling of contact. But right now we're at a four ounce feeling of contact just to get us in connection. So riding in connection so that we are uh, able to do a relaxed forward flat walk in rhythm with the correct mechanics of a head nod. So it's essential that there's connection. So I ride, this right here is a boche bit, and it is a snaffle bit, but it has a slight amount of pull. Um, a few years ago when I first met Jenny Jackson, when she started helping me with my dressage, uh, she noticed that my horse had a head wag, which meant that her head nod went like this. So she encouraged me to use a boche bit, um, a little bit of pole pressure, and it, it, it tends to straighten out the head nod. So I've been using this bit on and off. I toggle between this one and the full cheek stone that Philippe Powell uses in his training. Um, this bit I'm going back to as I started riding with this more connection feeling, and it seems to be working really well. Well, thanks for joining us, and come visit us at naturallygated.com. Mm -hmm.